Hello, I'm Martin Fenska and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Battle Brothers. So the plan for today is to end the Noble War and we'll have one last big fight. And then we can go exploring again, or exploring, I should probably say, like, unique item hunting. Uh, before we start playing, I would like to answer comments. So first of all, there was a question if uh, the game would let me join the fighting around Wasserkook. I think last time we saw uh, a company from Seestadt, from somewhere, heading south. I think they're uh, trying to attack. Actually, what are they trying to attack? Don't think they can pillage the harbor. Maybe they are going south, trying to cross the sea, destroy the Ember Collector. Well, they're actually... I'm not sure, but they're trying to attack something. So the question is, uh, would the game allow me to join the fighting? Well, as long as there is an icon on the map with the crossed swords, that there is a battle going on, I could join that. I couldn't just join, like, the pillaging of the... Uh, of the locations but actually now when i'm thinking about it let's actually we could just attack the no we can't i mean i'm not sure we might be able to just attack the workshop uh what is this but i don't always the sword take one of uh, one for the company seems to have single hand helped resolve the mess once also explains i don't know how to explain it as another more articulate mercenary says it's like he's more than just uh, a sword for how you know he's someone we can depend on like brother but another whole brother obviously more like the half brother a bro if you will well plus one resolve for two people everyone is happy that's a great event. How the hell did this happen? Um, banana found. I don't think that came from the militia. Oh, that's from the team player, I think. Okay, well, that's a great perk. I didn't know it uh, can proc this event. Nice. I like that. But, well, we'll try to check the workshop, because when we get closer, we should be able to see the garrison. When we see the garrison, we might be able to actually attack and just destroy the workshop. But, uh, the other question before that. Uh, that was about uh, ending the war. If I want to end the war here, or, or if it might be better to just uh, wait and maybe try to find some more fights like before last time I try to fight find more knights to get uh, better gear well the problem is it's not guaranteed that there are any more companies running around that we can just attack we destroyed two and the, the, the houses usually don't have that many so if i knew there were like i don't know two or three more companies running around that i can attack it might be worth doing but uh, it's also possible that there is just maybe, I don't know, one somewhere. It could be on the other side of the map and uh, we'd never find it. So I don't think it's uh, worth the, the risk, worth, worth the time, right? If it's the uncertain result, it could be just a huge waste of time. And I think it's just better to end war. It's not we, we, like we end the war without fighting at all. We still have that one more fight where we can get uh, the armor. I guess there will be multiple knights. Uh, we should be able or there should be a decent chance that we get the maze that we want from there as well. So I think uh, it's better to end the war here. But before we do that, let's go for that workshop. There should be... No, we can't do that. I thought that... Maybe we have to have a quest to attack these... Uh, these like locations around the, the enemy cities. Because I'm pretty sure... At least during some quests, you can attack... Uh, these structures around cities. Hmm. Okay, well... We can't do it now, so we didn't have anything to do. We are waiting for the morning anyway, so it's probably worth checking. Now we're gonna camp until the morning. That'll give us time to repair some of the damaged gear. And we should get... Uh, actually, uh, about ending the war. At this point, I didn't have a choice, right? It already started at the last uh, part of the quest. Uh, no matter where I would go here, we would get the, the, the last step. And I don't think we can delay this 
I have to fight here. I, I don't have a choice at this point. So what is hell of a thing? How does one sell man on it? Sir Balan does his best uh, pontificating on numerous subjects as he addresses his men. First he states that it is the honorable thing to do. Then he states that they are many soldiers here no doubt increasing the odds that some other schmuck will die instead of you health in numbers then he argues that losing this battle might mean losing their wives children at their country uh, this last number seems to work the best as the men roar with anger and energy through the uh, now cheering crowd of soldiers you can easily spot the uh, cynics and the sodomites onwards oh we are fighting right away okay here See, we have the knights. Many are ballisters. Scary. Few is not too bad. Lots of billmen actually might be the most probable or like most dangerous uh, enemies. But uh, we should have quite a few people on our side that uh, will just sacrifice themselves for us. 3, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 17. Uh, they still have the numbers. We have one nine. Actually, I thought that we would get more people. But well, let's just start this. We'll see how it works. Uh, how many dogs do they have? Like three, four? Oh, they have mercs. Okay, that's Master Archer. No, that, that's just Merc, but he has the uh, the tier one bow, so the guy is quite dangerous as well. Okay, wait. Oh, hey, there are more of them in the north. Okay. Wait. Okay. That actually kind of sucks because um, dogs are great for uh, proccing the extra damage. I still don't remember the name of the parrot, the one that gives 25% extra damage after a kill. So I was hoping that I would be able to proc that here. And they are moving forward. Oh, come on! I wanted to kill those, those dogs myself. There are two surgeons. We should be able to take care of this one. That's another merc. Yeah. Don't see any tier one maces yet. I guess if anybody has the base, it's gonna be the knight. Ah. Block the top. Oh, there is the mace. The, the surgeon has tier 1 mace, so we could get it here. Uh, Sauron. Okay, fine. This is not the perfect position because someone will have the advantage here, but uh, I want to start hitting them, or at least try to hit them. And the knight block. That, that's actually pretty good. He'll probably die at some point, but. He'll take a lot of damage before he dies. And meanwhile, we should be able to, to clear the area up here, hopefully. Uh, wait. Wait. Stavari can move forward. Start working on the sergeant. What about Kamiomutsu? What if I send him here? Want to know how many people are there coming from the north? Banana found. What about you, buddy? Just wait. And there is the knight. So that's the 300 point helmet, 300 point armor, the usual uh, knight gear. Nice. Where do I send Ankorus? I think up here. Nice. Now, 
Do we have any decent shots? I guess aimed shots will be the best. And uh, we want to focus on the arbalest there is. Yeah. This one. Good. 74. Come on, hit him. Great. Let's go here, I think. Sixty-one. Now let's try this guy. He has a very light armor, so if we hit him, it would be a lot of damage. Okay, I'm just gonna move forward. I think try to disarm this guy. Never mind. I was hoping that if I disarm him, I'd avoid a stun. Well, well. Ow. Ah, oh, come on. That's another Merc. And which way? Do I send Nidaros? I could go here. No, that's a bad move here. And we'll wait for this Y hunter to come closer. We'll, he will team up with Malice and we'll try to flank them. Try to get behind them, maybe. Johan. I think he'll send Joe north. Two, three, four. I don't think there are too many coming from the north, so hopefully come in and so Joe will be able to take care of them and then again flying them from the other side. Uh but I found let's keep trying, good. They have two more dogs, so with two more dogs, that basically means there's 31 of them. You really can't count the dog as like a combat unit. 68. Good. Don't attack my archers. Wait. What the heck is that? It's like another Merc. But those Arbalesters, look at the damage they're doing. What if I move Mahatma forward? Is that a horrible idea? It's, it's not a great idea, but... What if I move him here? It might be better. Guys, focus. That was good. Wait. And that's smart, they're not moving. Come on, that's the second miss. I didn't check the chance to hit, but I'm pretty sure it's like above 70 at least. Seems that there's more people coming from the north than I thought. There's already like five or six attacks coming from the Fog of War. There's another one coming now. Oh, right. We don't have to move and we have a target. 
Nice. And there's a holy moly. Where did all of these people come from? 48. Nope, that's not gonna work. Can we please hit something finally? What is this? Mercenary. That's an interesting gear. Don't think I've seen the helmet before. Good. Wow. Did he hit the single attack this, this turn? Okay, so the night will be a problem. I don't want to step forward because that would put me in the range of the Zweihand there. Wait. Come on, we we'll just have to keep the knights unlocked. But we can't hit anything. Yeah, there is a stun. Uh, that was good. That was great. Finally, someone is hitting. I move Ankurus forward, he'll just get hit by the Billman, that sounds bad. But if I send him north, there will be a gap in the line. I guess he'll just stay here, wait until someone moves on this tile. There, first zombie, nice. He's still alive. That's four arrows that he survived. Finally. At least we are getting the overwhelm stacks. Okay, good. Now we have a target that we can kill. Shouldn't be that difficult to kill him. Um, can we get a zombie from a dog? I guess not. Our hit rate, like 20% maybe, not even that. Oh. 77%. And we missed for the third time. Wow. Look at that, they hit whatever they want. Oh, 
That's also a third miss. Even we can't even hit the dog. I thought there was an arbalester somewhere. Wait. Okay, good. At least something. <laughs> Look at the damage the surgeon is doing. Did you see how they are hitting, or do you see how they are hitting basically everything, and we are missing, like, as I said, like, 70%, even probably more than that, uh, of all our attacks? One, two, I can't this or try to disarm this one there, that's nice. Okay, let's Oh wait, ah, uh, yeah. I saw this green helmet and um, that confused me a little bit. I thought he was one of ours. I wanted to get to the to the pikeman. Never mind. I can still use the split here next turn. Nice. Wait. I move here, might be better. Okay, he panicked. Finally, that guy should have been dead for two turns. Now we are getting somewhere. Wait. That was a wasted error. I didn't expect that to be one shot. Honestly, I didn't expect us to hit him, so... Kinda want to kill the Arbalester, but I think... I have to focus on uh, targets that are still fighting. Do I have a good shot? I don't see anything. I could try here. Well, it worked. Flank is falling apart. Come on, he didn't have a shield wall. <laughs> what the hell is that sword? It's one of the new ones. Eighty six, please don't miss.
don't think I can I just wait until I have time to step the the night. It's not a huge difference, 12%. I'll just try here. It's a bit greedy, but I think I can keep the night stun locked. Nice. 27. Holy moly. Battle Forge, Twilight Adaptation, Shield Wall. Nice. That's not nice. That was good. And they they um, stun the uh, that's why and they're nice. I think I may need some help up here. Nope. This is a bad idea. Also because Malice is pretty tired, you know what? I'll just use Recover. What the hell? Did you see those arrows? Wait. Oh, I can't reach him. Nice, 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 nice. So it's going really well on this side, but the other side is in trouble. I think I'll try to disarm this guy and finish off this ah, session. Damn. That was, what, 62%? That would have been a kill. And Sauron didn't hit anything in this way. Come on, man. What the hell is going on? I think this is the move and go for the cleave or well, well cleave with the with the hammer probably not for the like the, how should I call this attack because it sounds like cleave with the hammer is wrong they are cleaving with the sword how would this be called how is it called shatter hmm. let's go for the shatter okay I'll just leave it at that Kane is in trouble now. Seventy one percent miss. Come on. How did the surgeon survive for that long? Again, that's another unit that should have been dead. Ah. 
Nice. Nice. Perfect. Let's send some help up here. Oh, too tired. Well, I guess the knight will attack this time. <laughs> what the hell is going on? These arrows are flying all over the place, not hitting anything. Sixty-nine percent missed twice and three times. Okay, that's a fifth or sixth attack. I know that the chance to hit wasn't like super high, but um, it was like 45% in average and we missed like six in the rows. Uh, we could call that unlucky, I think, at this point. Yep, definitely. Oh, he just went for a post. Okay, that wasn't too bad. <coughs> 43. No, that's, that's not gonna work. I'll try to stun him first. Um, 46, it's not that low. take that much damage. I thought he'll take a lot more. <laughs> Finally. So that's one side solved. Well, try it. <laughs> this could still hurt. Uh. 
interesting. I have a shot here, but I'd probably rather get uh, the overwhelm stacks on this guy. Why am I even trying? Wait, let's try to get the stun first again. Oh, that hurt. Too tired to do anything, okay. <laughs> that wasn't bad. Is it time to switch the javelins? No, we are too far. Oh, they're retreating. Okay. That was a good one. Come on, 60%. You can do it. Focus. Aim. And nothing. Did you run? No, I saw that. You might have run out of ammo. That was easy. Sure, I'll take it. Oh, that was nice. It's the first time that I see Repose working that well. Ah, now he panicked. Good, okay. that's another problem solved. <laughs> Do we need to disarm anyone at this point? Well, I could try to save the night. Who is that? Sir Ballon. Oh, this is the general. Okay. <clears throat> Doesn't really mean anything if he dies or not, but I guess I'll try to save him.
we have one more chance. 47, 69. Can't do it. Focus once again. And get at least one kill. How many are there? Two of them are running. I think I still want to catch this guy. For Merc, he has pretty damn good gear. Look at the hit points. Uh, nimble. Fast adaptation, double gear. How the hell does he have so many hit points? So it's just this guy now. Let's actually try to disarm him. He did quite a lot of damage and I don't want to lose someone when it's 1 against 22. Actually, let's just say it's over. Really don't want to risk anything. So what happened? Bananafant ended up with the injured shoulder. That's not the end of the world. That minus 25% damage for someone who is using the web most of the time doesn't matter at all. And Kane got hit, he's gonna need some time to fix his armor, but other than that, we are in pretty decent shape. Let's see, did we get anything interesting? Mostly interesting in that mace that we did get. We got the bow. I don't think we need that. We got the sword. Um, did the knight have only 240 point armor? I'm not even sure this is worth repairing. Well, we got the maze at least. The battlefield is littered with the dead and those who wish they were. Sir Bond's men go about collecting their wounded and killing any enemies they find. The commander himself claps you on the shoulder, a flag of blood splattering your cheek. Well, I'm not sure if he is in the shape to clap anyone anywhere. He was like almost dying there with his last breath. That repost he managed to kill uh the what was it? Was it the footman or the sergeant? Like maybe a merc. I'm actually surprised he survived. Good work, Selsor, and I wasn't sure if your men would hold the end of the bargain, but you damned well did. Your employer should be very happy to see you, I believe. There, return to Zeshnad. Go. How many tools and supplies do we need? 56. We'll have to go shopping. That is our reward. Oh, the war is still not over. No, this is just the patrol. 78 crowns per head. 
it's over 2000. Still cracking the other Zesh that. We could maybe take this. What's the other contracts? Caravan Escort. Two long holds. That's too far. And package delivery. Two long holds, yeah. How much can we get? I think the prices are decent. So I will sell everything here. fresh recruits I think it's the same what it was the last time we are here okay so that will be or this will be all for today uh, I'll think about the contract I'm not sure that I want to spend more time here although Probably if we, will, if we went this way, we'd be able to find a camp or two, just kill some brigands, get those heads, and the reward that's 500, and then 78 per head for 20 heads, so it's almost 1600, that's uh, like 2100 uh, gold for something that we, we could do in like day and a half. Might actually be worth it. How much money do we have? 44k. The thing is, if you go to Stall and Krakenwader, then I would rather go to Dragrafen and we could go south, visit these two cities. We have two locations. Actually, we could just go north and go after these two locations that are guaranteed. And we have guaranteed fights where we can get heads that might be worth it. It's not that far from Krakenwader. Okay, fine. I think I will do it. But it's gonna be next time for the VR done. So I hope that you like this episode. I hope that you're gonna join me next time again. And until then, have a good time. Bye bye.